Hey, what is up you guys? This is Rob. So here's the thing guys. Usually I like to talk about some pretty fun and cool mods for Tacoma. However, today we're going to go in a little bit different direction. We're going to talk about a nice little uh, preventative mod for Tacoma. This is to help prevent rust on it guys. No one likes rust guys. It ruins every car and every truck. So here's the thing. When Toyota designed the Tacoma, there was one little flaw that they had left in it. Now the AC drip hose that actually is dripping water onto the frame right now. So if you go on the forums, you're gonna see a lot of search and Tacoma owners who've had their Tacoma for a few years talk about how there's now surface rust on the frame on that location where water is constantly dripping on it. So I figured, hey, let's fix the issue. So the best way to do it is, to me, to redirect the water. So what we're gonna do is we are gonna redirect the AC water to, instead of dripping on the frame, to drip away from the frame. How are we gonna do this? Well guys, you can do this with less than $10 in materials. You might even have this already sitting around your garage. So I have the three feeder hose. So I have two and a half feet. You could probably do it with less. It really just depends on where you wanna route it to. Two of these wonderful tightening clamps. We all love them, or we all just love to hate to use them. And three eighth on both ends barb. This is how we're gonna be connecting the three eighth hose to the AC. So we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna show you guys how to install this. So let's go ahead and let's get it. All right, you guys, so first things first, we're gonna get to the actual hose. So we're gonna take off these two with the trim tool. So just pop the buttons off. So that's one. And then the second one, right there. Let me get, let's get the pry in right here. There we go. And we should be able to just pull it off. And there we go. So now that we have this off, the hose is right back here. So now let me go ahead and show you guys how I'm gonna attach everything. All right, you guys, so you see the hose right there? So let's go ahead and we are now going to extend it. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and let's get the hose ready to get in there. So first off, we are gonna take one clamp, put it on. So some people, they prefer to get a bigger hose and put it over the smaller hose. I don't like doing that. That's why I'm using a barb fitting. To me, this is a bit of a, it's a bit of a better, more, I don't like saying this, but we'll say a bit more professional way to do it as opposed to just, you know, putting a soft tube on top of another soft tube. So we're gonna go ahead and stick the barb in there. Go ahead and put the clamp on and tighten this out. onto it so it doesn't pop off. While I do that, like I said guys, it's really going to depend on where you want to route it to. So I'm going to route it um, pretty much a bit more in the lower area towards the back, a little bit kind of towards the cat just a little bit. So now that's tightened on. It's time to actually, uh, you know, put this hose onto the AC hose over Alright guys, so let's first you know, put this end back there. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead I'm going to slip that in. So remember guys, you want to use this clasp to tighten out on that end. So let me go ahead and let me get in there. All right, so I went ahead and slipped right in. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and take my screwdriver and I'm just gonna tighten this out. Uh, you guys don't need to see that obviously, so I'll show you guys after I tighten it the next step. All right, you guys, so I went ahead and I ran the wire. So what I did was I zip tied it right here, just onto, uh, you know, this little hole right there just to kind of keep it stable. And then we just go under and you will see, let me get the light. There it is. Nice and easy, guys. You know, definitely a nice and easy way, uh, you know, to protect your uh, protect your frame. Now we have everything nice and fixed back there. You know, just have to put the covering back on. And guys, this is a really easy mod. You know, I, like I said, I did put all of the items that you're gonna need in the Amazon links below. So go ahead and check those out, guys. Definitely recommend doing this ASAP. And with that, guys, you know, if you have any other questions, comments, let me know. With that, this is Rob and have a good one. Thank you.